claim what is yours. Joshua chapter 14, verses 8 to 12. Nevertheless, my brethren who went up with me made the heart of the people melt, but I wholly followed the Lord my God. So Moses swore on that day, saying, Surely the land where your foot has trodden shall be your inheritance and your children's forever, because you have wholly followed the Lord my God. And now behold, the Lord has kept me alive, as he said, these 45 years, ever since the Lord spoke this word to Moses while Israel wandered in the wilderness. Now here I am this day, 85 years old. And yet I am strong this day as of the day that Moses sent me. Just as my strength was then, so now is my strength for war, both for going out and for coming in. Now therefore, give me this mountain, of which the Lord spoke in that day. For you heard in that day how the Anakim were there, and that the cities were great and fortified. It may be the Lord will be with me, and I shall be able to drive them out, as the Lord said. We have the record here of Caleb. 45 years since the time Moses spoke over his life and said that mountain that you climbed on is yours. You will have it. 45 years later, Caleb comes to Joshua and says, Joshua, you remember what Moses spoke over my life? Today, 45 years later, he says he was 85 at that time. And he says, I'm ready for battle. I'm ready to go and take that mountain. So give me this mountain which Moses spoke about. He was claiming what was declared as his inheritance. And I want to use that to encourage you that, I, that in life, no matter what battles you and I face and no matter how long the delay, how long we've got to wait for it, let us claim what is ours. Let us say that this is our inheritance. We will have it. Let us choose to win. Let us not let the delays in life Sometimes the detours in life, the disappointments in life, rob us of our inheritance. Let us not let them take, take or withhold the, uh, the, the blessings, the promises uh, that God has given to us. Let us claim what is ours. Let us choose to win. For that, we, like Caleb, must say, I can go and get it. I can possess it. Just as Caleb said, I'm ready for battle. I'm ready for war. I'm strong today as I was then. God is with me and I will take that mountain even though there are giants there. Take your mountain. Claim what is yours. Possess your inheritance. Choose to win. Let's pray. Father, we thank you that you are with us, that you enable us to possess the promises you've given to us and we will possess our inheritance we will take our mountain in jesus name amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org